Hi, my name is Alicia Waddell. I attend Northern Arizona University. I'm in Dr. Sarah Mueller's Chem 235 class. I am currently doing my presentation on acrylic acid, so I hope you enjoy. Thank you. This is the chemical formula for acrylic acid, and as you can see, it's CH2, CH, COOH. Acrylic acid is commonly made by converting propylene into acrylic acid. This is done, as you can see, by taking C3H6 and certain amount of moles, as you can see, there's three different types, if my finger wasn't blocking it, of three different moles of oxygen. As you can see, we have 1.5 moles of O2, and down below we have 2.5 and 4.5 moles of oxygen, which all end up creating your CH2, CH, COOH as your end product for acrylic acid. Common uses for acrylic acid include plastics, i.e. baby diapers, textiles, thickening and dispersing agents, surfactants, shellacking agents, adhesives such as tapes, water-based coatings, and water treatment agents. In liquid state, acrylic acid has been known to be a very strong irritant towards the skin, eyes, and the mucous membrane in humans and it can also cause blindness if it does get into your eyes. Short-term and long-term effects of acrylic acid have been done on animals just to see what occurs and for the short term they have noticed when rats inhale the acrylic acid um, eyes and nose begin to irritate, there's lung hemorrhages and degeneration changes in the liver and kidneys. Acute testing was done with the acrylic acid on animals via inhalation and oral ingestion. With the inhalation, they noticed lesions of nasal mucosa and with the ingestion, they noticed weight loss and altered organ weights as well. With all this testing that they've been doing on animals, um, yes, they've seen Changes in the animals, like I said, weight loss, lesions, um, damage to the organs, but there has been no evidence at this time that it is harmful towards humans in the long run. So I'm curious to see how scientists will test and find out how it will affect us in the long run. Hi, so that was my presentation on acrylic acid. And like I said before, my name is Alicia Waddell. I attend Northern Arizona University. I am in Dr. Sierra Mila's Chem 235 class, and I hope you enjoy. Thanks.